getting worse. It's good. It's now it's bubbling and starting to, you know, bubble up. But uh, I mean, it started off as a, as a small one, but it's gotten big pretty fast. To avoid making matters worse, Joy and her family have not been able to park in front of their house for months. It's unsettling. I mean, it's yeah, it's annoying. It's, um, you know, it's a waste of money because this is like a lot of water gushing out. Gushing out and streaming down to the storm drain, two houses down, where her neighbor Tom Weed lives. Oh, yes, yeah, so he's got a nice little fountain there. The, uh, the question is, when is that going to collapse? Because you know that there's a big erosion under the street. And the same issue a few blocks away on the 2400 block and the 1900 block of Palmer Street. This one starts in the middle of a heavily trafficked street. I mean, I'm out here a lot and doing stuff in the yard. And and the, the, I didn't, the bubbling part where it was a fountain coming out of the street, that only started a couple of months ago. Initially, the street was just kind of wet. And every time somebody drove over it, it smushed out a little water. And so the street just kind of stayed a little bit wet. And then it got wetter and wetter and wetter. And now we got a fountain over there. Residents there say so far the gushing water has not affected the water pressure 